Good day, and thank you for joining us here on Anastasia Radio. Let me take a moment to introduce myself. My name is Stephen W. Pierce, and I'm the founder of Sustainable Consulting Technologies. We're going to take a moment here to really define in a very clear way what is sustainability in our view, and what are we are all about when it comes to sustainable developments, buildings, or homes. First, our view of sustainability is very, very straightforward. We look at a three-step approach and we must look at it this way to reach what I call true sustainability. The systems that we employ must be economically sustainable, physically sustainable, and socially sustainable. To build a completely integrated self-sustainable development, building or home, you have to bring all the pieces together and align them based on these three principles. As we all can see, economic sustainability is critical. We've pushed the world to the brink at this moment and we've created a global economically unstable world that is literally creating a, a lack of security for hundreds and millions of people. Sustainability is really about answering the question of economic sustainability by creating a quality life and even a higher quality life at a lower economic cost. And this is exactly what we do within the state-of-the-art integrated systems that we employ to develop a development, build a building, or a home. The next step is physical sustainability. Many times we only think about in physical sustainability in connection to economic sustainability is lowering the energy cost. In other words, we lower power and we lower the amount we have to pay for it or lower water usage, we are then becoming more sustainable. And that would be true. But when we think of sustainability, we think of it in the broader stroke within the physical realm. If a building, home, or development cannot stand up to natural phenomenons that are within nature, they're not going to be sustainable for very long, and you're going to have to replace them, rebuild them, and redesign them. So what we did is we found an integrated system that is not stated technology, but a proven technology that's been in the real world environment, plus tested at almost every level, that meets this goal of true sustainability within the natural environment. In other words, a sustainable system needs to be tornado and hurricane resistant, earthquake resistant, fire resistant, mold and insect resistant. And we'll be talking more about that system and how it works and how long it's been around in future segments here on Anastasia Radio. Third, we need to have something socially sustainable. There is a lot of really unique designs within what we call sustainable architectural uh, systems. But that's the problem and it's also a good thing. They're unique. Unique is a great thing. It's unusual, it, it, it's something we all like to look at, but the problem with Unique is there's only a very few people that would live in one of these style buildings or homes, and most people don't see themselves as being in that kind of place. So when we look at social sustainability, it has to fit into what we call the mainstream. In other words, we have to have a system that can pretty much be designed to any architectural style so that the person living in that home is comfortable with the home aesthetically. And we have accomplished that as well. So remember, sustainability is really not as complex as we may think. It's pretty simplistic. And if we can just keep the three things in mind, it must be economically sustainable, must be physically sustainable, and socially, we can apply that out in many different ways. But we start with the base concept based on what I just said. So I really am glad that we have started this radio program. I'm glad that you're here today listening to it. I invite you to come back again. I think you will enjoy the spots and they will be informative to you and help you understand more about true sustainability and integrated self-sustainable systems that are proven technology that are being applied today all over the world and within the developments we're involved in. Thank you once again and have a great day.